Yo, what's up everybody? Sergeant Pope here again. Today I have a setup video. Yeah, you heard that right. I haven't had a setup video for maybe like a year or two, so I figured it was about time. So let's check things out. Yeah. Oh, uh, and before I start off this, um, this video, it's kind of like two parts because, um, by the way, I'm in college, but uh, I uh, still live with my parents, so... Um, I guess you don't like that, then fucking deal with it. But uh, <laughs> but basically, here's my mom's house, and I'll show you guys my dad's house after this. But over here, I got two cats. First, we got Mavi over there. He's a fat black cat. His full name is Maverick from Top Gun. And then over here, we got Goose. He's a crazy fucking cat, too. He's pretty cool. He's kind of a pain in the ass sometimes, but he's a nice little kitty cat. What's up, Goose? Egg? <laughs> so, yeah, there's my cats. That's probably the best part of the setup. But, uh, moving on, um, by the way, this camera's also really nice. I guess, by the way, there's me, there's my setup. That's me. What's up, everybody? But my, my camera is pretty awesome. It's a Canon Vixia HF. There's a microphone on top there, which is pretty sweet. Um, so I guess that's set up, too, because this camera was like 1500 bucks. Um, but let's move on to the, onto my PC, because I know this is something a lot of people like. Up there, I got a bunch of external drives, basically just for videos. That one all the way on the left is a uh, Buffalo 50 or 500 gigabyte USB 2.0, just for storing videos. The one on top there in the Inatech enclosure, uh, which my camera won't focus on, is actually a solid state drive. I reviewed it, and uh, now I got a solid state drive for really fast transfers while I'm editing videos. And then underneath that, I have a Western Digital, um, just for basically uh, two backups, because um, external drives uh, always fucking break, so it's best to have a backup. Uh, the computer itself is a Cooler Master HAF uh, 922, I believe. Um, has a bunch of red fans, which a little bit of cat hair, but uh, I try to keep on top of that. But goddamn it, my cats just get so much fucking hair. Um, but yeah, definitely a lot of red LED fans, which is sweet. And um, try not to fuck up this one. Uh, the processor inside there is an uh, AMD FX uh, 8150, so it's clocked at 3.6 gigahertz, and it's an 8 core processor. Which seems like it's pretty good for uh, for uh, for rendering videos, which is what I do a lot on this computer. By the way, this computer really isn't gaming; it's just basically for rendering videos. So the graphics card isn't that crazy. Um, but the cooler, uh, the CPU cooler, which I believe I have some cat hair on that too. Ooh, yikes! It's a Cooler Master Hyper Evo 212, which is pretty good. It's pretty cheap. It's very very quiet, which is why I really like it for one thing. So, moving on, uh, the graphics card, like I said, isn't too crazy. It's a Radeon XFX R7770, um, so it's not bad at all. It's good enough for editing videos, and I could definitely do some gaming on it, but uh, I don't do gaming on it because this computer just really isn't, uh, I mean, I could do gaming, but I don't know. It's just better for editing videos, so yeah. Um, some nice fans, I guess. I really like the 200mm fans. There's three of them um, because they're all really quiet. Um, so that's a fucking awesome. I got a wireless card there, and um, I don't know, 16 gigabytes of RAM. I bought RAM on this computer before it was fucking expensive. So like, I got this RAM, 16 gigabytes for probably for probably like 80 bucks. And right now, if you were to buy it, it'd be like 160 or some shit like that. Just way too over fucking overpriced. But uh, there's my computer. Nothing really too crazy. Um, 800 watt power supply because I, I at one time I thought I was gonna do gaming on this computer and get like two graphics cards. But then I didn't, uh, so, um, yeah, whatever. Um, so anyways, uh, I don't know, I got some nice speakers, got the amp right there, some subwoofers, some speakers. Um, got a ViewSonic 22 inch, um, 1080p, which isn't too crazy, but not too bad. There's a video I do a lot of, uh, commentary on, which is a blue snowball, and I got a little pop filter in front of it. <coughs> which is pretty cool. Coke Zero Cherry, which is awesome as well. Uh, on top of that, I got a Microsoft um, something keyboard, which I like a lot. Got a Kings, uh, Kensington mouse, which was really cheap, but I kind of like cheap mice because I always throw them everywhere and I fucking break them all the time. Oh, and that's the webcam I do some stuff with. It's a uh, Logitech something something something. I don't know what the fuck it is, but I've done an unboxing on it. So if you guys want to check that out, I guess. Got a printer down there as well, which is awesome. Moving on over to my TV and everything. I got this TV uh, last year, I think. It's nothing too crazy. It's a Samsung. Uh, oh, look, my, my camera's trying to pick up Rodney Davis's head. Uh, that's just some political guy around here. Um, but yeah, it's a Samsung 1080p. I think it actually might be uh, 120 hertz, but who cares? 
Um, it's not too bad. Also got a splitter back there, which helps me uh, decrypt HDCP video, which is nice. Got a soundbar on my TV, which all, which is also awesome. Uh, it's it's a big subwoofer in there. This is a whole amp and everything. And that's the soundbar right there, which is awesome. Moving on, I guess here is my uh, router. It's an Asus router, which is pretty good. It's just a wireless in, but it's really fucking awesome. And that's what I record videos on, is a Hophog HD um, PVR2, I guess. Yeah, which is awesome. Got a bunch of batteries and battery tech I'm still reviewing, which is awesome. Some razors, gotta keep that facial hair under control, motherfucker. Oh, look at that, some guitars. I only use the one that's in front, this red one right here. Um, because all of the other ones are like fucking broken because I fucking break them, but <laughs> uh, yeah, cool. I got my PS4 hitting right there. Got some anti-itch cream because um, I got poison ivy a couple weeks ago and it fucking sucked. And cough drops right next to that because right after I got poison ivy, I got a fucking cold, which was, oh, Jesus. It's not related to this video at all, but it's fucking terrible. So PS4 in front, then my PS3, then an Xbox 360. Interestingly enough, I have three Xbox 360s. This is the only one that actually still runs, so um, that fucking sucks. <laughs> uh, but it's Elite, which is really nice. Um, PS3 Slim, and then the, the PS4, of course. Which is cool. I like vertical consoles, by the way. Um, I love having my consoles vertical because it, it takes up a lot less space. Um, I also have, a, have that old computer. I'm just still kind of fucking around with it, which is cool, I guess. I have some games. I got some Gamefly stuff right there. And then I got, like, Black Hat or Ghosts and shit like that. Got some more games down here, which is pretty sweet as well. Got an air conditioner right there in case it gets fucking hot. And I guess that is pretty much it. Yeah, cool stuff. I don't know. That's pretty much it. I can't really think of uh, too much else. So at this point, Mavi, I think we're going to head on over to my dad's house. So and now we're here back at my dad's house. And of course, um, I don't have any cats here. And of course, it's the same camera. So we'll just get right into some awesome stuff. I guess I do have some pictures of, of a cat right there. Look at that. That's close enough, right? Um, but let's start off with uh, my computer because I figured that's probably the most important thing. Uh, it's right here. It's a Cooler Master. Uh, I think it's on a, like an Elite 371 case or something like that. I really don't like the case too much. Uh, it's kind of a pain in the ass for some aspects. Um, it's kind of a small case and... Uh, eventually I might want to upgrade the case, but I don't know if I really am going to, I don't know, but uh, anyways, you might you might see a Noctua fan right there. I replaced all the cases, or all the fans on the case with Noctua fans, which is awesome. So a front Noctua fan, a side, and then a back. I can't do anything with the top because my aftermarket cooler is so big that I can't fit anything up there, which kind of sucks, but uh, you know, that's what it is. We'll take off the Noctua fan cover. And here's the inside, and it's already really dark. Um, you know, I guess it's winter already because it's already really dark. So I got to use my uh, my flashlight to guys show you guys what's inside. But uh, I've worked on my cable management a little bit on this PC. It's still not perfect, but as you can see, it's not too bad. Really, the, the bad thing about it is the case, like this. You know, this the CPU, um, I guess, power cord. I can't do anything about that. So if you complain about that in the comments section, fuck off. I can't do anything about it. Um, but it's a Dawson power supply, by the way. It's a cool, uh, it's not a cool master. It's a thermal tank, uh, tough power grand, 1200 power, a 1200 watt power supply. Um, it's semi modular. It's not fully modular, but it's, um, modular enough. So it's kind of nice. Um, and basically I got 1200 watts because one time I had an 800 watt power supply and I fried the thing. Like it started like melting and everything. So uh, I got this cause I hope, hopefully it's a little bit better. Um, the graphics card right now is an XFX R9 290X. It's uh, the black edition. It's fucking crazy. We'll see if we can get a nice uh, angle of it underneath there. Well, maybe not. I have some unboxings of it if you guys want to check it out. But it's an awesome, uh, awesome graphics card. Uh, let's see. The processor in there is an AMD FX 8350. If you guys haven't noticed by now, I like AMD products. I think they're cheap. Well, they're cheaper, and I think they perform pretty much just as well. So that's why I get them. Uh, the CPU cooler on there is awesome as far as performance. It's not awesome as far as uh, actually like sound goes though, because it is loud as shit. Even with these Noctua fans that are pretty quiet, this uh, cooler is just loud. Um, but it does a good job. It keeps the computer between like uh, around like 20 to 40 degrees Celsius, which is pretty awesome. It's exhausting through the top, by the way, so uh, it gets the heat out of there. Uh, I do have a hard drive in there right now, which kind of sucks. My other computer has a 120 gigabyte solid state. This one has a terabyte hard drive, which kind of slows it down, but this is a gaming PC, so it's kind of hard to go over to solid state quite yet on gaming PCs. 
So that's just what it is. Not too much RAM as you'll see, only two of the four slots are filled up. Has eight gigabytes of RAM, but I just can't justify putting more money into RAM right now. It's just not worth it. Uh, as far as the PC goes, that's pretty much it. The monitors are pretty great. Uh, this first one right here is obviously, obviously the main monitor. It's a ViewSonic 23 inch IPS monitor and it's just crazy. The colors are just incredible. I don't really know if it's that great as far as gaming, but like as far as refresh rate and response rate and everything goes, but um, I use it for gaming and I like it a lot. This one over here is just a crappy Acer monitor. It's just a second monitor I have set up, but it's not too bad. It's 1600 by 900. Uh, by the way, this one's 1080p, obviously, um, but uh, it's a good little second monitor. Anyway, so it's a pretty nice monitor. It's got some, uh, I don't know, some really old speakers, but has a big subwoofer down there, which is pretty nice. I guess speaking of subwoofers, on top of that is another subwoofer. It's a wireless one for my soundbar, which we will talk about in a little bit. But that thing booms like crazy, especially if I'm playing Call of Duty on my PS4. Damn, that shit's crazy. Oh, by the way, these lights. Let me turn them on. I don't know why I even, I, I didn't even think about turning these lights on, but I got these uh, awesome uh, solo cup lights, which are pretty freaking sweet. Oh, uh, the keyboard, by the way, Modern Warfare 3, hell yeah. <laughs> this keyboard was so cheap that I was like, fuck it, I don't even care if it says Modern Warfare 3, I'm going to get it. Um, but the mouse is really nice, it's a Gigabyte, um, uh, let's see, M6900. Uh, it's pretty awesome, to be completely honest. It was only 30 bucks, and it's just great. Um, so, uh, cool stuff, got a nice chair, got a gaming chair right here, which has some speakers, it's pretty nice. Uh, let's see, I don't know, here's a nice headset that I got for my PS4, um, it's that gold wireless stereo headset, which is pretty awesome. Got an Xbox 360 steering wheel that I really don't use too much anymore, but it's kind of cool whenever I do use it. Uh, there's another Hot Pog PVR, because I record a lot of gameplay. Basically, I just don't want to carry my PVR everywhere I go, so I just bought two of them, one for each place. There's my router. That router was $200. It's freaking crazy. It's AC wireless. Uh, it's the Asus RTAC66U, uh, I think, or something. But it can send uh, wireless signals on um, the 5 gigahertz band at 1300 megahertz per second. Uh, or th 1300 megabits per second, not megahertz. Um, so that's pretty fast. Uh, and then the modem is, uh, yeah, it's not anything fancy at all. Cable box isn't any fancy, is anything fancy at all, although it's kind of funny that I have it vertical because it's not designed to be vertical, but I was like, fuck it, I'm not going to find that much space for a stupid cable box. Here's my TV. It's actually not that crazy, to be honest. It's an O Cosmo, but it actually is pretty nice for the price. It was only 250 bucks. It's 40 inches, and it's 1080p. LED and everything is pretty awesome. It's really not too thin, either, or it's not too thick either. Uh, as far as uh, audio goes, I have a Sharp soundbar, which is playing the demo thing right now. It's definitely a pretty awesome soundbar. It's only two channel, which I kind of wish there was like a third speaker in the middle, but that is what it is. And then of course, the wireless subwoofer, which is crazy. And uh, I guess that's pretty much it, uh, besides, you know, the Space Age gaming machine right here, which is the Xbox original, the true Xbox One. Uh, I still use it sometimes. I think I still have Halo, one, Halo 2 and a Halo 1 port. Um, so it's definitely pretty awesome. Only one controller, which kind of sucks, but, uh, you know, whatever. Uh, then we got some games, some PS3, some PS4, and Xbox 360. So I guess that's pretty much it for this uh, setup video. Hopefully you guys found it kind of cool. Let me know what you guys think about it in the comments section below. If you like Steve Harvey and, uh, you know, the Family Feud and everything. They always have black families on there, I swear to God, every time. But, uh, you know, whatever. So thanks for checking out this unboxing video. Drop a like, or not this unboxing video. I'm used to saying that. Thanks for dropping out, or thanks for checking out this setup video. Drop a like on it if you did like it, and I'll see you crazy motherfuckers later. Peace out. What you doing, Goosey? What you doing? Whoa, what you doing, kitty cat? Oh.